A cloud of doom and gloom settled over the Bowie County Courthouse on August 26, 2013. On that day, one of the county commissioners declared to me that the county was broke and there was not enough money in to pay the bills. Another commissioner declared that we had a cash flow problem so serious the county would have trouble meeting payroll in October and would end that month about $648,000 in the hole. Of course, none of this was true. It was a cruel fabrication. It hurt our employees and it hurt our citizens. You see, Bowie County ended September with a cash balance of $2.2 million and ended October with $1.6 million in the black, not $648,000 in the red as previously predicted. Unfortunately, bad news gets repeated more often than good news. In fact, this good news never found its way into print. As one reporter said when presented with the actual numbers in November, oh, that's old news. What happens when bad news gets repeated over and over, louder and louder? Panic begins to set in. County government begins to mirror the national government in Washington. It becomes government by crisis. A crisis, even a manufactured crisis, can be used to justify more and more control by a select few. Road equipment was unnecessarily sold early. Needless hiring freezes were instituted. Even illegal spending freezes were attempted. When the baseless panic begins to subside because the facts don't back it up, a new mantra is required. The new fabrication had to sound even more alarming. The new lie? Bowie County's General Reserve Fund is $1.6 million in the hole. That was not true either. But when repeated over and over and over, news editors accepted it as absolute truth and the man on the street no longer questioned its validity. Then, suddenly, the inflated lies were burst in one hour's time on Monday, March 31st, when the independent auditor's report was posted. The truth broke through like bright sun after a dark storm. Bowie County's general reserve fund did not go 1.6 million in the hole. No, according to the independent auditor's report, Bowie County's general fund balance actually went up over $400,000. Will this undeniable truth stop the fear mongering? It could, but it probably will not. Some people will say or do anything to save face, and after all, this is an election year. However, I am the type of guy who believes that truth wins out over time. I agree with Abraham Lincoln. You can fool all of the people some of the time, some of the people all the time, but you can't fool all the people all the time.